Hey guys, an outfit of the day video and I'm going to start with the jewelry so that you can get a good look at that. The earrings that I have on are just some rhinestone studs from Forever 21 and we'll go down to the necklace. And for the necklace I have on this, see if I can zoom in on it here. I have on this rhinestone bib necklace from Element, and I absolutely love it. I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I do. And it goes all the way back, as you can see. But I didn't want to have it droop, you know, down too low. But it, this is absolutely gorgeous. So I have on this rhinestone necklace, and then excuse the nails, and this peach color um, ring also from Forever 21. So that's what I have for the jewelry. And then as far as the outfit itself, adding to it, I am wearing this uh, like salmon color um, shirt from Forever 21. And I like it because it has like, it's really loose and flowy and it has like a slight bat wing um, thing going on with it and it's a high low shirt and I actually have to cuff the sleeves over some but it's a high low shirt and to give it um, some shape I tucked it into my um, jeans in the front and then I have on a my favorite belt um, this is from Hollister and I wish I would have purchased more than one of these this belt is about six years old so I have on this belt and then some red skinnies from Target. And then um, as you can see, like I said, I have the shirt tucked in in the front, but I'm letting it hang loose in the back. And for the boots, I am wearing my um, brown everyday uh, boots from Target and they're really comfortable. They go with everything. So I just have these on. Hey guys, an outfit of the day video and I'm going to start with the jewelry so that you can get a good look at that. The earrings that I have on are just some rhinestone studs from Forever 21 and we'll go down to the necklace. And for the necklace, I have on this, see if I can zoom in on it here. I have on this rhinestone bib necklace from Jewelment, and I absolutely love it. I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I do. And it goes all the way back, as you can see. But I didn't want to have it droop, you know, down too low. But it, this is absolutely gorgeous. So I have on this rhinestone necklace, and then excuse the nails. And this peach color um, ring also from Forever 21. So that's what I have for the jewelry. And then as far as the outfit itself, adding to it, I am wearing this uh, like salmon color um, shirt from Forever 21. And I like it because it has like, it's really loose and flowy and it has like a slight bat wing um, thing going on with it. And it's a high-low shirt and I actually have to cuff the sleeves over some. But it's a high-low shirt and to give it um, some shape, I tucked it into my um, jeans in the front. And then I have on a, my favorite belt. Um, this is from Hollister, and I wish I would have purchased more than one of these. This belt is about six years old. So I have on this belt, and then some red skinnies from Target. And then, um, as you can see, like I said, I have the shirt tucked in in the front, but I'm letting it hang loose in the back. And for the boots... I am wearing my um, brown everyday uh, boots 
from Target and they're really comfortable. They go with everything. So I just have these on. And because I will be um, running errands today with the family, I am also um, just going to wear my trench coat because it kind of gives it, um, it keeps the feel dressier, casual. And let's see, put it on. Probably should have started with this on. But I have my trench coat. Um, and I got the coat from H&M. Absolutely love it. And I just attached um, faux fur collar to it off of one of my sweaters. And I pinned it on so it, I don't have to worry about the wind blowing it off. And I'm not, it's a sh um, short coat. It comes right to my knee. And I'm not going to... Um, button it up at least it's not the plan but it, even if I do I tied it in the back to help give it more shape and structure so it's not um, so boxy looking and as you see if I was to button it up it would still give it some form so I'm wearing this coat with it Let's see if I can pan up some get my color in this is the coat, and I will roll you guys up. I have to figure out a better method with this tripod thing because it's not the best, but it's what I have right now. So, um, and this is what the top of the coat looks like with the fur collar on it. And you can see it from the back. And then as far as um, hair, I have a fishtail braid that I did. This is my, was my first attempt, so I think for my first time I did pretty good. Just need to tweak some things next time, but it took forever.